the NRC Adams Licensing Support Network Library how-to video series using the facet tree and facet chart. The facet tree and facet chart can narrow a search by identifying the most common document properties called facets by the Watson search engine. Properties include the addressee name, author affiliation, document type, and author name. Clicking on the arrows next to each facet will display the most common results. For example, you can find the most common authors of records on the desert tortoise, a threatened species near Yucca Mountain, and then limit your search to just those individuals. The facet tree will display about 15 of the most common names or terms, but you can look at all the authors on the desert tortoise by selecting the More Facets link. A pop-up facet window will display all the authors. You can scroll through them or search for a specific name by typing it in the filter box. The facet tree will also help you identify variations in the way the same name was entered into the LSN library system from different sources. For example, an author might have been added by last name and first initial, as scientific publications do, or their full name may have been added. You can look at all of them by selecting the box next to each name and clicking on the Specify Search Terms button. The facet chart on the right performs a similar function as the facet tree, but displays its result as a bar chart. If you select the author name facet and hover the mouse over an entry, it will display the number of results for that name. Clicking on the name immediately displays the results. If you are not using the facet tree, facet chart, or time series chart, you can collapse these sections by clicking on the small arrows highlighted on the screen. The NRC Adams Licensing Support Network Library How-To Video Series using the time series chart. The time series chart at the bottom of the search page allows you to limit your results to a date range. For example, Hovering the mouse over the bar for 1997 displays the number of records for that year. Select 1997 by clicking on the bar and then the magnifying glass icon on the left side. You can further narrow your search by choosing a particular month within 1997. The time series chart also allows you to select a range of years. For example, click on 1997, hold down the shift key, and then click on 1999. This will limit the results to just those three years. For more help, call the NRC Public Document Room staff at 301-415-4737 between 8 a.m. and 4 p.m. Eastern Time, or email them at pdr.resource at nrc.gov.